what's a good team I have with Uzuku here, a, a famous Chicago judge. I just want to ask him a few questions about um, Yu-Gi-Oh. So, what do you think about your current state of the game? Uh, it's alright. I like that I didn't evolve a lot. And that uh, it's not just like one deck. Well, actually, I'm one of the ones that actually prefer the one deck that makes everyone. Right. It's like, it becomes easier to side at that point, then it really comes down to skill. But right. Now that there's like two, three, even random, like decent road decks that can do well, just part of the side, and you can just lose to anything. Like, right. Being too prepared for one deck and then get blown out by one that you're not prepared for. Right. I don't know. It's okay, but I think it could be better. Okay. So, how are your experience judging? Uh, judging? <laughs> well, uh, as you know, I don't really judge anymore. Right. But, uh, when but I you did, did for a long time, like eight years, right? Huh? You did for like eight years, seven years, right? Uh, actually, no. It was only like three and a half. Okay. I know you were one, you was one of the top judges for a while. Yeah, uh, I, I was head judge of uh, the Illinois Regional right. for a couple of years. Uh, when race stepped down, and uh, my job was just to train other people so that they could do it. Right. And uh, when I was doing it, it was great. Like I, I got to travel a lot. You know. Volunteering for Konami and the YCS events. Like, like, like you know, I was traveling to. If there were like nine YCS right. a year, I'd be at least like seven or eight of them. That's good. And, uh, just traveling all over the, the country was awesome. I had to meet new people, make new friendships. Right. Try new foods. <laughs> that was great. But, uh, get out of the crappy, freaking bipolar Chicago weather. Right. Uh, it, was, it was great actually, but it's just. You know, we gotta move on eventually. True. Life yeah. hits you. So. Definitely. Yeah. How's your Nationals experience so far? Right now, uh, pretty crappy. Okay. Uh, two and two. Okay. Not doing very well, but I'm not playing one of the better three decks. I'm playing uh, Lancian, Murgo, right. And you know all the rules too, because you use the judge yeah, 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 at a high, high level. I know how cards work. I know how probably problem some of card text is. Right. Very good at that, and I understand it. And that gives me an advantage, but, you know, if you're here at the WCQ, are decent enough and qualified. So, granted, right. it's 2,200 people. It's way more than I expected. Right. By the way, it's like 620. Yeah. And we just finished round four. Barely it's finishing round four. We're in time still. Yeah, it's nine rounds today, so it's long. Yeah. And long Beach all over again. All right. All right. Final question. What would you? What kind of advice would you give to future judges? Our future judges. Uh, don't beat yourself up when you make mistakes. Right. Uh, we're human. We're not perfect. Um, take it from me. I've been future match judge plenty of times. And I've made mistakes. Uh, people know, in fact, uh, the, the big one. Uh, I was actually the future match judge when uh, Jeff Jones made it to the finals of White Toronto. Nice. And he summoned the Trubies using a Trigodian. Oh, fuck. I was the future match judge at that event. Oh, and I let that go. Granted, the head judge was there. A lot of us missed it. Right. You know, when you're in the heat of the moment, you don't really catch it. Yeah, but uh, I got informed by many people afterwards. Did you, are you the future match judge? Just let me go, and you get a lot of flack for being wrong. But right. You know, 12, 13 rounds on the weekend, and you don't get much sleep. It's rough. So I don't beat yourself yeah. up when you make a mistake. That's the number one thing, and uh, you learn from those mistakes and be better. Uh, learn to listen. There's always people who have more experience than you, and that's just something you're gonna have to accept as you're trying to learn and, you know, further yourself in the judge program. Um, I don't judge anymore just because of, you know, life. Right. Yeah, it was a great experience. I learned a lot. It made me a better player. It made me a better judge. Right. Um, yeah, just learn how to accept being human and that you can make mistakes and learn from them. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for the interview. Yeah. Yep. I mean, everybody's just to learn their deck just to uh, try to get over Dark Destroyer. I mean, just running weird text and I mean the thing about Cosmojo it's literally an out to 